Today's top story, massive snowstorms blanket much of the country and more is expected in the coming days. Whiteout conditions stretching over 2,000 miles from Texas to Maine. Frigid temperatures causing freezing rain and ice, downing trees and power lines. For more on this colossal storm, we go to our reporter, Brent Rodriguez-Gonzalez, braving this mess down in Houston, Texas. Brent, how are you coping? Yes, Bill, we're hanging in there. The temperature is dipping to a brutal 37 degrees. Forecasters are warning the temperatures may drop even more and the sky will open up and dump a quarter inch of snow, paralyzing the city of Houston. (coughs) Local officials are urging people to hunker down and please wrap your pipes. Let me repeat, wrap your pipes. Bring in your pets, let them sleep in bed with you. Put a sweater on them. Go into the attic and find the winter coat that you have from the ski trip a few years back. I can't feel my fingers! Five pairs of socks will be mandatory. I need my Snuggie! All area schools will be closed. 37 degrees is way too cold to have your child walk from the car to the front of the school. Did I forget to tell you to wrap your pipes? There's so much wind! Being that we're in Texas, you won't find tire chains at the local auto parts store. So go ahead and rip down your kid's swing set and use the chains from that. The big one is coming! Local Congresswoman Sheila Jackson Lee is holding a press conference today to urge Houstonians to stay warm. Must I die? Must I die? If we survive this storm, you will need to wake up at 2.30 in the morning in order to get to work with your snowshoes. Where'd my earmuffs go? But I wouldn't leave the house for a week if I didn't have to. Make sure you wrap your pipes. People are really losing their minds here, so I'm going to have to go. This is Brent Rodriguez Gonzalez reporting from the frozen tundra, Houston, Texas. And now back to New York. I-